Get the life. Go up there, get the life. What? Up to the right is some life. It's a med pack. It's a med pack. Everybody knows it's a med pack. And a med pack is what you need now. Go and get that med pack. Go and get the med pack before you die. There you go now. Go upstairs because that's where the modem is and it's good. Hey, you made it out of there. Depends. <laughs> uh, we like having fun with the elderly. Hey, what's happened? Nolan North. Troy Baker. That's him. Welcome to another just hair-raising adventure here at Retro Replay. <laughs> Do you want to tell them what we're playing? I'm so excited. It's the movie tie-in day. Uh, hey, welcome to Retro <laughs> Replay. I'm Nolan North. No. That's the, Troy Baker. And the beauty is, is that if they clicked on it, they know what we're doing. Oh, that's true. So we can't like, there's no like surprise. All right. What they don't know is how we're going to do it. I have been dreaming about this okay. ever since one uh. night I went through and I had forgotten about, there are so many bad movie tie-ins. Now I will let you interpret that as you will. Either you can say that I'm calling the movies bad right, or that the tie-ins are bad or both or in, in cases. some cases both. But I figured we would do a double, maybe triple feature. Okay, did you ever go to the movie theater and you like just stayed in there until they kicked you out? Yes. Okay, that's what we're going to do. But that's do. usually when my friends and I were up to no good. So. Yeah, we're up to no good. Do you remember the 1993 classic? Sylvester Stallone. Yeah. He did. He was a, <laughs> he was a mountain climber. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> cliffhanger <laughs> cliffhanger let's um, go okay so, so cliffhanger you it's a game. game your bird's stalking hold on let's see okay radio do, 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 please do. help we're stranded we were hiking and lost our bearings jesse the winds are too strong to get a chopper up there it's a girl you'll have to rescue them on foot all right gabe and hal veteran rescue climbers are summoned to help the stranded hikers, but unexpectedly discover a plane crash. Mm -hmm. <gasps> what happened to the hikers? Well, I don't know. It, wasn't it Rooker? Yes. Michael Rooker, our friend who's been on the show. Yeah, Travers, we lost three metal boxes in the plane crash. Quaylen, get out of suits, pants, socks, $100 million. The usual stuff. John Lithgow. John Lithgow. Let's go. Is it let's go? Let's go. Let's go. I need to get that money and save her. I just hope I can get it before they do. I know it's cold, but I figured I'd wear my t-shirt. Rolled up. Rolled up. Yeah. You know, my biceps dun, dun, can't dun, get dun. Me. Oh. Look at this guy. Look at who he's fighting. This is great. No. It, it, Where was he at? Where was he like a... It's like, you know what? Hey. We didn't know karate. Like, you never do like, I'm going to jump kick you. And I love look, I like the fact that the guy is wearing like jungle fatigues in the snow. Not too conspicuous. Look at this guy. Oh. I brought a knife. This what looks this looks a little a little uh, familiar, doesn't it? Kinda does. What does it look like? Bowsley <laughs> brother! Come you... bounce with me, brother. <laughs> bounce. We load double drag bounce. bounce. We and bounce the nice this is this is New York after the Holocaust. Oh my That's God, a little double dragonish, doesn't it? Hey, I look a little. I got beat up. It's all right. You hey. want to jump kick a guy with a knife? Because it's, well, yeah. it's hard. to flash. That's you the with first a thing knife. they teach you. Oh, you streets. got a knife? Pick it up. Can you pick it up? I don't know. Uh, if you we're can pick about it to up. find out. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Get the knife. Get the knife. Oh, you got it. Now I got a knife. I'm the snow. A good job, advice. Maybe make a cocktail. Nice. Oh. oh, wow. Wow. That's way more right. effective. Oh, yeah. Oh, that guy's throwing him. Oh, that's not right. Okay. Okay. Maybe I can catch the knife. I'm okay. Man, the animation on this is so, so it's like, I oh, would get that knife. Get knife. that knife. I want I that. I can't. Get another one. That's, oh, get that knife. That's nice. There we go. The oh, thing that drives me crazy, and this is why it's always a bad tie-in, is that they never, like, it, it's never the movie. It's never like, it's like, I don't remember these guys being in this and... But I got something interesting. Okay. Which, the, the movie inspired a game. And today, the, the game games, they're trying movie. to inspire movies. A little, little, uh, 
little one to grow on, kids. <laughs> uh, and most of those movies uh, fail miserably. I don't know what I'm doing. What's... You do the exact same thing where you disappear just like you do. But what's, what, what's... You don't die. That's what you do. Right? Hey, I don't like this guy. I don't like you either. And I jump and kick you in the face. Come I hope I'm here. not telling tales out of school, but when Graham was on uh, the Rambo movie with him, he had to do this big stunt where he gets in this big fight and then like has to go all the way down to like the river. And it was a, it was a big stunt thing that he had to do. And Sly comes over and he was like, Oh, here he comes. Here's my director, this great action star, is gonna tell me, unlock some secret of wisdom to help me guide me through this stunt. And he goes, Hey, Graham, don't fuck it up. Rolling. And that was it. That was it. And that was his whole. How do I grab the knife? How do I grab the knife? What you... Carefully, because you wanna make sure you do the handle and not. There you go. All right, I just good. wanna make sure I know what I'm doing. You're what doing I do. It. Oh, I just threw it. Shit. Name name of the most surprising Sylvester Stallone performance for you. Uh, surprising? Yeah, like, wow, it was Oscar. Do you remember Oscar? He plays the... Oscar the Grouch. The crime boss who's going to go legit for the day. And he plays like... It's like all... It's a, it's a, it's a total play. I am Everything really takes not good place. at this. I know. These are, that's what I'm saying. These are terrible... This is like... Hey, the movie did well. I just wanna, I wanna, don't punch you. I, I gotta pick up my knife. Make it fair. I will knife you in the neck. How you feel about that? You know what I'm saying? Let me pick get up that knife. All right. I don't like that one anymore. I, I cut got you guys. And, uh, I, I'm gonna kick you. I, I'm gonna slice you. I, I'm gonna kick you. Uh, oh, you stabbed me in the back. That ain't fair. Do you look at him as as John Rambo, or do you look at him as Cobra? Do you look at him as Rocky? <sighs> Rocky. Do Rocky you? was the first one, I, but I, I, I'll tell you something. You can say whatever you want. I, I enjoyed his movies. Of course. I always have. I, you know, I mean, just... Expendables? Why are there three guys? This doesn't seem fair. Look at him. Hey, you got me in a corner. He did that in the movie. We did, we did Transformers together, and they literally wrote out for him, Hey, yo. Right? Like, hey, yo, what are you doing? Shut and he up. Goes, they did not. Hey, oh, I don't get this. What is this? And Jamie Simone had to be like, to do help. Ao. He's like, what? Ao. What is that? Ao. He was like, no, like Ao. Ao. Like, hey, yo. Getting your ass handed to you, man. You have the controllers, not me. Cliffhanger. Ah, we gotta go back to the beginning. So as I mentioned, this is a triple feature. <sighs> Ooh, so we don't have to watch Sly run through the snow anymore. I will give you another hint of what game we could play. I think I know what it is because this movie was recently on in my hotel room. And I was like, there's never enough time to watch this movie. Let's do it. You know, you think it's me all the time, but it's not. We are going... JVC, shouldn't it be JCVD? Please tell me you've seen that movie. No. <sighs> this, it's, this is weird. So I love, Because it has I love absolutely the nothing to do the with... The puffy jacket. The puffy jacket. Right? He always rolled up the sleeves. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, we bring you Jean-Claude Van Damme in Time Cop. There is never enough time. Time Cop starring his wife in it, um, oh, Mia Sarah. Mia Sarah. Who is Sloan Peterson in Sloan. First Bueller's Day Off. Here's what you don't know though. What? Whilst Jean-Claude Van Damme starred in the movie, it is not him in the game. That's Explain. not him, brother. Well, I, it's a little That's a a pixelated guy. No, they actually shot everybody on a blue screen and like captured all their animations, kind of like they did for Mortal Kombat 1. So you're playing, it, it, they got like real people. It's a pixelated version of them. Like, look at this, this title screen. What the hell is this? This had absolutely nothing to what do are, with the movie. With the, what's with the squids? What's with the underwater in them? I'm in a... Weird ship thing shooting squids. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but that looks more interesting than the movie. You bite your tongue. Are you kidding? Come on, time cop. I have to take you back with me. American man, you know, I just taking an opportunity, that's all. 
get to take you back. It's break this down for me. How there's one thing about physics that everybody knows. Same matter can occupy the same space at the same time. That is true. It is not true because it's a completely falsified thing made up by this movie, but it's been proliferated throughout our cultures so that everybody accepts it as fact. But it's Jean-Claude Van Damme. JCVD says it. It <laughs> means it's true. Well, I love actually, these guys in the white. Let's get to this game. These guys who just kick without any knees. No, but it's like... I, don't, I wonder why. Go why ahead. Me? Go ahead, because I play cliffhanger. These guys just <clears> go, <throat> kick. But, but like, watch, what is this movie? But here's oh, what, what I like game? about this. Go. I like to watch watch him walk. He walks like Jean-Claude Van Damme. So if his stats is standing... Thanks to Max <clears> Walker, <throat> you know, the most and, American name ever, and the Time Enforcement Commission, TEC, the time travel system created by Professor Hans Klein that didn't fall into Senator Aaron McComb's hands, or President McComb. A new security system called Timescan has been developed to intercept immediately anyone who tries to change the course of history. The use of time scan allows Walker to leave his dangerous job of time enforcement. After a last routine mission, he got ready to leave TEC offices when he noticed a new logo on the electronic devices of the company. HKA, Heinz Klondes Electronics Incorporated. <clears throat> so Professor Klondes, the inventor of time travel, wasn't dead during the first experiment. Walker is suddenly teleported. He finds himself in a new building seized by armed guards who bring him in front of Klondes. Kleindaz hails Walker as the last human allowed to travel through time. This isn't in the movie. They had to create their own narrative. I feel like this is the first pitch of the game. Oh, or first pitch of the my movie. Oh, goodness. He jumps in. Hey, look how cool Whoa. I am. Hello. Hi, I kick in the face. I kick, look, Hi, I love look I kick that, in the that face. Is, that, that, looks, that looks, so, that's so German. He's like, I kick you with, with no force. But can you imagine like, so um, Peter, thank you for coming on set today. Uh, yeah, what's, I, this, I'm, I'm for my first gig. I'm really excited to be an actor. What, so is there a scene? No, 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 no. We just need you to stand in front of this blue screen. Oh, okay. Uh, and we like for you to wear, wear this white suit. Okay, and what do you want me to do? Oh, I just want you to, to extend a leg, just I'd like that, and then an arm. Anything else? Nope. Yeah, I just want to kick you without minimum effort. Are there he kicks him and just disappeared? Yes. I think he's a ghost, right? No. Let's go over here. Hi. Hi. Bump, oh. bump. Oh. I will now, you him. also have a gun, because... I'm time cop. I'm time cop. I come back but up like, here. There's no... Oh. That was pretty. That was pretty sweet. It's like but I don't, the more I don't realistic it looks, the worse it Look is. Look at him! Ah, I kick you! I punch you to the other level. Go, 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 go! And then what are like the this random... guy just took three bullets to the face? Oh no, I fell, but I'm oh, okay because I'm time. It's cop. okay. There's never enough time. You guys have heard us say this line like countless times. It's the first line that he says in the movie, and it's brilliant. Because it's when oh, you see... Oh, you didn't see, tell me you had a gun? I told you you no, had a gun. No, that guy. Oh. It's the first line that he says, and he's like the bright chipper version of, of Max. There's never enough time. In the movie. And then, you know, you, you know it's been uh, a, a, like a hard 10 years because he has the long hair, and he's got like the scruffy beard, and he doesn't care as much. And he goes and he goes, gets in the car and goes, home. And he goes home to his home apartment, where as he used to have that like idyllic house that blew up with me and Sarah. <sighs> I, I can't get over this game. It's so Can bad. you play this a little it's, bit? I have. I just need it's to, go to... terrible. <clears throat> I don't understand the, the, the white bat. They look like Dr. Evil's henchmen. <laughs> and, and they just like, I kick you without any knee. It's just a straight hip flexor kick. Look. Look. Boat. And they just kind of walk up to you. Uh, <laughs> I love the jump. It's just like the most epic... <laughs> but look how he punches. Punch. Look how the punches. Go like, away. I go shoot. Away. I shoot I you. I shoot. I shoot you. I don't want to be here. I have like no idea where I'm supposed to go. The door opens and closes for no random reason. These guys, these henchmen, I, it, there's no way. This is what I'm saying, man. But it's, you can't even tell if you hurt them. Oh, no. And then you're dead. You lose. All right, I'm going to try again. I'm just see if I can't figure out. I think wow. just, it's just B and A, man. Do you know something? I, I Normally, you know how I am. Not very good at this, right? At this kind. I don't care. I don't care <laughs> that I'm bad at this because I don't think anybody could really be 
good at this. It's just bad design. It's bad. It kind of looks like God. they look like like you know <laughs> Devo cosplayers. <laughs> it's like what are we doing? Yeah, kick him. I want my goggles. You can shoot if you want to. You can travel all in time. But if you die, then you die here, and you can go back in time. And uh. Well, we can dance if you want to. We, we can fight. We can fight. There is never <laughs> enough time. <laughs> it, it, nothing will ever make me hate that movie. Are we basically playing what? It, it, like everything, like every actor was in the Expendables at this point? Not yet, but we could if you want to. Yes. Who the, are we missing? I, I will give you. I will give you a choice. There's, well, of course, is Arnold. Yes, has to do something. But of the '90s, do you want to go like James Cameron blockbuster? One of the most expensive movie at the time when it came yeah. out. It was the most expensive, mainly because Terminator. No, well, which, that which was one? two. Total Recall. No, but you're close with the T's. Another one that I do know is a game is True Lies. Jamie Lee Curtis. Nailed it. Oh, Jamie Lee Curtis. Jamie Lee Curtis did that little dance in yeah. that movie. Even when she fell down, that was like cute and endearing. She's beautiful. Yes! So there's True Lies. <clears throat> there's I like that. Uh, there's also Last Action Hero. I haven't played either of them. I have two questions for you. First, why am I dealing with you when I could be doing something dangerous like rearranging my sock drawer? That was a line that was written? And two, how are you going to snap your fingers after I rip off both your thumbs? And two, how exactly are you going to snap your fingers after I rip off both of your thumbs? Either that one is, who does the doctor treat? No, yeah, who does the doctor treat? Patience? Look at the elbow of my jacket. What is it doing? Wearing thin? Exactly. Boy, that was a stretch. Who does the doctor treat? Patience. Look at the elbow of my jacket. What is it doing? Wearing thin? Bingo. Brilliant movie. Uh, last action hero. F. Murray Abraham. Sir Ian McKellen. Playing death. Oh, man. I like those movies a lot. Last action hero. All right, fine. I do. Okay. I've never played this game, so I have no idea if it's any good. Did Dolph Lundgren ever get his own game? Because he was in Expendables. Universal Soldier. Oh, come on, look at that man, Danny Madigan. Let's go. Let's go. It was. Like, How do you remember that? Because Last Action Hero was, was like my jam. It really was? It was. It was kind of like a modern version of of Neverending Story. Here's a kid who got picked on. That he his escape instead of books. His escape was movies, and he knew all about him. And he especially liked um, Arnold Schwarzenegger's character, which was... Last Action Hero. This. His name wasn't Last Action Hero. I was like, Mr. Hero? Yes, you can call me Last. I am glued met... to his seat watching a sneak preview. Jack Slater. Jack, Jack Slater 4. Danny Madigan. Man, you remember the name. Catapulted towards the screen, a flash of light. When his eyes, Danny finds himself clutching the sidewalk outside a school building. No, he didn't. He found him in the car. School is what? being held under siege by Zakathic acts, mainly act. Ripper. No, this Standing. is what happened to Jack Slater 3. Jack Slater 3. Oh my God, this is terrible. Go ahead. I got to see how bad this is. Oh, no. See, in Jack Slater 3, Jack Slater was on the roof deck uh, dealing with uh, the Ripper, whatever. His, I can't remember the character's name, but he had his son and he holds his son over. And wow. that's where Jack look Slater. At the, look at the reach on this one. I punch. That's supposed to be Jack Slater. Wait, he's like a condor. Look at the size of his arms. That's supposed to be Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> this is but, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Uh, his daughter. I will jump over things. His daughter was played by Brittany. No, come no out Tiffany. Here. What was her name? Um, hey, come here. Come here. Don't pot. Don't do that. Don't do that anymore. She's married to Pete Sampras. Um, oh, he, his kids go to my school. My son's school. What's his wife? Yeah, but, but, uh, uh, come on, Drew. Help me out. Well, I didn't think you'd know off the top of your head. When I say help me, what I mean is Google it for me. Slater! Bridget Wilson. Bridget Wilson. I ran into her at Gelson's. Did you? And we kept going down the same aisle, and it looked like I was following her, and I wasn't. And then I finally said, uh, hey, I love your work. Like that, that LA phrase. She was like, 
my God, thank you so much. And then I thought to myself, what is she doing now? Like, I haven't seen her in a while. And, oh, she married Pete Sampras. That's what she's doing. So like in this movie, Danny Madigan has a friend who runs the movie theater, um, who's like an older dude, and like they share this love of, of movies together. And then the friend says, you know, I've got a magic ticket that was given, me, given to me the night Harry Houdini died. And it's supposed to be this magical ticket. Kid takes the ticket, and that's what transports him, of course, into Arnold Schwarzenegger's movie. Oh, I hate this game. It's bad. I can't get, I can't, the, the guy's got a bat. I, I growing up, had a next door neighbor, Duffy who was an older guy that was like a friend. Did what? you have anything like that? Did you have like- I did not, did I have a Duffy? Older guy who was a sure. friend? Yeah. No, he was arrested for it, being too good of a friend. But that's like, I don't think you could, I don't think you could have that now. But like, it was totally fine when I was growing up. He had like, like this guy sounds like an indigent, but he had like- like the cool guy who gave you porn when you're too young? No. Yeah, that's not cool. He had, but he had a Volkswagen. Yeah, let, me ask, let me tell you something, Duffy. Uh, he had two Volkswagens that were like, uh, that no, would sit no out windows? in front of his house. No, they had, <laughs> they had windows. <laughs> My buddy Duffy had a windowless van. But he had, uh, he had, he he had a son that was a musician named David. I don't remember this. And God David played dance. drums. Come on! And Get David in close was to the guy the, with the bat. Come on, help me! I'm in the middle of a story. Oh, sorry, I wasn't listening. Nobody was. David had, Dav Duffy had a son named David. Who played drums, and that's what made me want to play drums. Really? Yes. Well, that's kind of interesting. Stretch. This does not look anything like that. Doesn't look anything like Arnold Schwarzenegger. At all. all right, we're gonna give this one more shot, and then we're gonna maybe True Lies was the better route. Ooh -wee. First of all, who matches their jacket with their shoes like that? Well, you know, it's not. It's like a leather jacket. It's not. It's not yellow. I just ran through him. Maybe I'm a ghost. This guy, he's oh, fighting. Looks like Bobo from the Bigfoot Hunters. This is even a boss fight. Why do they feel the need to turn everybody like martial artists? Like they turn Sylvester Stallone like into a jump spin kick, you know, they're giving him parkour stuff. They're cool enough in the movies. Why are we never satisfied just like with what they are? It's just never enough. <laughs> it's never enough. This is terrible. Game over. Thank goodness. Can we God. just go to something else? Last, that was terrible. Let's, let's, Let's do the and go into True Lies or something. Yes. Harry emerges, Harry emerges from the icy waters and onto the chateau grounds undetected. This is like the movie. Okay, Harry, you've got to attach the modem to the computer upstairs and download the files. That's exactly what he does in the movie. The place is swarming with guards, so keep a low profile. Don't worry. It's exactly what they plan to do. Hello? Uh, no. That's what I plan to do. No. The place is swarming with guards. I will go this way and like, hello, excuse me. Uh, I'm going to keep a low profile on yeah, that Yeah, you keep a low profile with your gun. <laughs> but nobody's shooting at me, so I'm just trying to... It's the tango that gets him. Uh, Hold on. I... Oh, now they're shooting at me. Why are you shooting at me? You're crazy. I need to kill you now. Like, what'd you do? What'd you do? Oh my everyone. god, it's a bloodbath. It's a bloodbath in here. It's like he could have just walked in. You needed to connect a modem. Instead, you turned into a complete psychopath <laughs> and decided to annihilate everyone in there willy nilly. Oh, just blood. Don't worry. There's so much blood everywhere. Hey, how you doing? I just wanted to go put something on the modem. But at first, I turned you into a hamburger. When he goes in the elevator. I, I, I'll do the chopper. When he goes in the elevator. And she's like, say something. It's a beautiful animal. <laughs> this is your, your last, last life, life, Harry. <laughs> All right. Well, Live your best life, Harry. Go ahead. Okay. Could, it, could I get up? Excuse me. I don't want to. I don't want to melee you. The door's, door's locked, locked, Harry. I have the pass card. No, you don't. What do you, you think uh, you got that? I thought that was a pass card. No, it's ammunition. I, just I told you that. That's it, Harry. You're dead. Please say that. Oh. Oh my God! <laughs> you blew up the world. Holy that crap! Is, that all right, all escalated right, all right, quickly. All right, I want to play a little bit. Hold yeah. on, hold on. So you lose, and the world blows up. <laughs> well, that's what you do. Like, remember they steal like a nuke. That that's was the right. Whole thing. That's right. That's right. Okay. Okay. I, we, the Crimson Jihad, will this raise fire on the one U.S. Doing. city every week. Why are you doing then, this? What? Why are you, are you doing this? What are you doing? 
battery as is. I think there are some in the truck to go get them, you moron! He's great! It's one of the best! And Who he's was sitting it? there, he's like, What is this? Tell her what this is. I don't know what this is. This is an espresso machine. And he like grabs. I don't remember. Oh, show it to him. As a demonstration of our power and Crimson Jihad's willingness. But as is. I, I, I remember a good villain. I just don't remember the movie. Bill Paxton. He was in it? You've never seen this movie. I don't remember. Bill Paxton is like... Uh, <laughs> I don't remember the I movie. I was like a 10-year-old boy. <laughs> there it is. Make you stand up and scream for more. Let's just Please, play sir, the game. I have a little dick. It's pathetic. Play the game. Oh, my God. I'm going to make you go home and watch this I movie. will go watch it. It's <laughs> a, I remember it being a great movie. Okay, Harry. You got to attach the modem to the computer upstairs and download the files. Let's see you do that. Maybe if you just don't fire your weapon. That's maybe. what I'm doing. And you sure as shit came in guns blazing. <laughs> so. No, only when they started shooting at me. <laughs> there we go. I am so much better at games. Especially when you go through the first level before <sighs> me. And I get oh, to there's fix. the gun. You didn't get the gun. It's over there in the kitchen. Yeah, but I've got... You should get the next life. What was your favorite Schwarzenegger film? I mean, dude, True Lies has got to be right up there. It's, it's, I mean, I Commando and Predator are are just classics. But man, I loved True Lies. Clearly, I mean, I can quote a lot about that movie. That I loved the classics. Uh, but there is get just, in there, shoot him. That's what I'm trying to do. But look, I've got four bullets. Four bullets left. Oh I can God. get into this game. I know. I'm super into it right now. That looks important. Uh, good work, Harry. The modem is connected and we're downloading the information. Now get the heck out of there. Oh, okay. Wait, I wonder if there's just... Is there a back staircase where I don't have to go through a thousand guys? Just keep rolling. Oh, no. Oh, get me out of this house. This is your, your last, last life, life, Harry. Come on. Come on. Now, now I'm into it. Let's go. Oh, there's a guy. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Ah, keep running. Keep running. He was running. I was running. I have no idea where in the house I am ah, right now. Just just keep rolling out of there. What a great mechanic. Hey, you know you can make it through this by just being a gymnast. <laughs> <laughs> just jump, barrel down the stairs. You got to get out the same way. You got in. Go uh, go left. No, straight. Go straight. It looks like a front door. That looks like an entrance. You got to shoot that guy. Oh, come on. Move, move. I don't want to kill go. you. I I'm a have good to. guy. Go, you're outside. No, yes! it's going to put me on a snowmobile. Good work, It's going to put me on a snowmobile. Please I know. put him on a snowmobile. <sighs> put me on a snowmobile. Go, I've got all the info downloaded, Harry, but the terrorists are heading your position. Get down here as quick as you can. This is exciting. Come on. By the way, this is what. Oh, oh see? no. Okay. This is a much better adaptation, except for the fact that I'm on a snowmobile right now. But you can be a little snowball. Look at you. you can, I'm going downhill fast. I'm out of control. Ah, get to the chopper. I have no idea if I am. Oh, can you oh! <laughs> get it? You could have. Shoot. Oh, there's no helicopter. Come on. There is now. This is. Keep barrel rolling. I am. I am. I. Ah! <sighs> Please. Oh, I got some oh, more health. Oh, you got health. Because I ran into it. You gotta get out of the trees, man. Look at these guys. <laughs> ah! Come on. Okay, we're obviously getting quiet. Whenever oh, we get, I made it to the truck. Get in uh, the van. They're still just give closing me the goddamn in. code. Oh, uh, it's the best. I am up her skirt and I am going for it. Just give me the goddamn code. Ugh. I don't. I can't do this when I don't know the references. Fast Faisal strikes again. I'm in. I'm down, baby. I got my hand up her dress and I am going for the. Just code. copy the goddamn files, okay? Man, I, I want to go see this movie now. Okay, I'll tell you what. This will be here. Let's go watch True Lies. And then we'll come back and do it? And then we'll go watch Time Cop. Okay. Cliffhanger? No. No. What do we want to play next?